All right. Hey, folks. Hope everybody's having a great day. Coming to you with a Saturday mail day. It's being filmed on Friday right after did the giveaway video, but you're going to see it Saturday. Uh, it's been a pretty fulfilling week in terms of the amount of mail I've received. I've actually, I'm actually waiting on a couple of big items uh, to get here this afternoon. One of them was a trade, but I want to go ahead and get this video filmed. Um, I'm going to start off with small stuff. Because there's so much, I'm going to move on pretty quickly. Uh, this was a lot I picked up on Blowout. It's a lot of colored and numbered stuff. Uh, not a lot of big things. I meant to keep that with the rookies. Um, but the lot was, there were a few key things, a few key cards that I wanted. And the lot was cheap enough so that it made uh, purchasing the entire lot worth it for these four or five cards. But these are a couple of rookies. Uh, these are numbered out of 299, the purple chrome. J.D. Davis might have a pretty good year. Got a couple of Miguel Andujar Topps Chrome Prism rookies. A Jeff McNeil uh, Sepia. A couple of Andujar uh, Pink Chrome. And these are from... That's from, different, that's from this lot. <laughs> a Royce Lewis 2017 Chrome. And a Devers Topps Flagship Rookie out of Series 1. The rest of the stuff wasn't really worth going through individually. Um, from another seller on Blowout, I picked up five Julio Rodriguez first Bowman cards. Paid 55 for that. Not a bad deal. Uh, from another Blowout member, got a couple of lots from this person. I've mixed them up a little bit, but I got a lot of... I've been, pick, been picking up a lot of Corbin Carroll uh, when I can from Sapphire. But picked up his stuff, some Michael Bush, Braden Shoemake, some more Miguel Andujar, Braden Shoemake, Andujar, Carol Shoemake, Andujar. You see a lot of Sapphire here, mostly the same guys. Alec Baum, there's a Torres rookie, a, a Scott Kingry sepia, a bunch of Miguel Andujar, Topps Chrome, some more Bush, Nick Madrigal, first Bowman, Larnick, or Larnish, Evan White, first Bowman Chrome, that's a refractor. That is too, the Trevor is. Joe Gray Refractor and a couple of Helio Ramos Refractors. Got my cat up on the table here trying to make some noise. From a Blowout Forum member who's also a viewer, Christopher, got this nice uh, pink chrome 2018 update of Austin Meadows. And he threw in a couple of, uh, a couple of extra Meadows cards, so I appreciated that. Um, at actually... I meant to show that last week and I set it aside to make sure that I, I thanked you on the video and I forgot to include it in the video. From eBay, from one seller, I picked up this Ahmed Rosario Topps Chrome Update uh, Orange Refractor Auto out of 25. And also this 2017 Sapphire Tyler Glasnow Rookie. And they came from Hawaii, so they took a little while to get here. From Blowout, I got this lot. Sam Hilliard, First Bowman. Jeter Downs Rookie Auto, First Bowman, a Shoemake Refractor, First Bowman Auto, and this Oscar Mercado. These three will probably go off for grading at some point. I expect to get a nine on the corners of the Jeter. It looks good on the front, but on the back there are a couple of little soft spots. The Oscar Mercado, I'm not going to have graded. There are a couple of the uh, infamous Bowman Chrome bubbles uh, in there, so I'm not going to have that graded, I don't think. Can't remember if I showed this on last week's video or not. If I did, I apologize for showing it again. I got this Austin Meadows. It came right around the time that I filmed that video. I don't remember if it was before or after, but this is the uh, super short print. Nice card. From a blowout forum member, I got this Raphael Devers Tops Chrome Auto. Of, uh, I like it when it's in the Tops sticker, the Tops case. I don't think I'll send this off for grading. It does have a couple of soft corners. That does happen on occasion with... Uh, redemptions from Tops. From another forum member, I got... Oh, where is it at? Where is it at? Oh, it's back here because I'm going to send it off for grading. I purchased a card, and he threw in a couple of extras, which was which was really nice. This Wander Franco Minor League uh, Heritage Miners card. This Jared Kellenic First Bowman Refractor. That'll probably go off to PSA. And then this Julio Rodriguez Bowman Chrome Auto. My first of him. That is going to go off to PGS. I have a little order that I'm going to submit tomorrow. From 
uh, an eBay seller. I got these two cards, two different lots. Ahmed Rosario Gold out of Finest out of 50. Rookie. And this one I really love. It's a 2018 Heritage Ozzy Albies Real One Auto. It's always hard to see uh, his auto. It seems to be light. Um, centering is not great. I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet, if I'm going to have it graded or keep it raw. But I'm excited to get it. It's going to go into PC. And you'll see another Albies thing here soon. Uh, this was part of a trade, these cards. I got... That came from an, a blowout member. It's the Chrome out of $9.99. It's pretty well centered. Probably go to PSA at some point. But this was a trade. I don't remember what the cards were that I traded. But I got a Freddy Peralta. Got a cat here beside me. Got to get down, buddy. Got to get down. Get down. You just heard the cat fall. Oh, no, man. Just is about to go by. Huh. Freddy Peralta Bowman Chrome. And a Refractor Peralta Auto. A Dakota Hudson auto out of 2016 david fletcher refractor out of 2017 ozzy alvis chrome and a rafael devers chrome another trade that i did uh, i had purchased from this guy or traded with this guy the week previous but i picked up three miguel andujar 2018 update golds or, i'm sorry series one golds a keston hura refractor out of 250 from tops chrome update or tops chrome can't get my sets correct here those i think should be going for a little higher than they are the sapphires i want to say the sapphire print run is like 1100 and it goes for about 200 dollars. this one has a print run of 250 and it's about a 75 dollar card right now raw and then i got this aquino uh, 2014 bowman chrome blue auto has a nine on the corners not crazy about that but it is a nice looking card and it's a blue i do like the i have a I have an affinity for the blue autos the bowman chrome autos um, so glad to have one of those in my collection for now and i purchased i'm going to end it on this i purchased a tops transcendent 2019 vip pack these were given out at the at the uh 2019 transcendent party in phoenix i think uh, i got this for 200 dollars on ebay it came from japan they are, there's a buy it now. You can buy them for like 300 or something like that. I waited for an auction to come around. I bid and I won it for $200. And then I, after I won it, I realized you can pick it up for $200 from Steel City Collectibles also. Uh, but these are, these can be really hit or miss. I think I did okay. Uh, first two cards, I got three one of ones. And I thought about having a standalone video for this, but it's only four cards. So I didn't think you'd want to see a 40 second video. And it was only after I opened the pack that I thought, well, I could do it with another like as part of the mail day video, but you know, it was too late by then. But I got this Alex Colomb 101 out of 2019 tops. I don't know why they would ever consider putting him in a pack like this, but there you go. It's a $2, $2 one-on-one card. Got this Charlie Blackman 101 out of 2019 tops. It's probably a $15 card, $20 card. We're moving up in the world. And then I got this, which I think is very nice. I'll slide the bottom one out of the way. A 2018 Bowman Chrome, first Bowman Chrome, Nolan Gorman, one of one. Nice card. And this one is my favorite. A 2018 Topps Finest, Ozzy Albies Auto, numbered two of two. So excited to have that in my collection. This one will not be graded again, like the Devers, it, even though it's not from Topps. It does have a little bit of a corner issue, a couple of corner issues, I think. Um, but I just like having Albie's autos in my collection. So that's for me. I'm going to hold on to that one for a while. And that is my Mel week for you. Hope everybody's having a great weekend. Hope you have a great day, great next week, and I will see you soon. Bye, folks.